Hey there, a huge thank you to all the names on screen right now, the renegades who click the join button down below and contribute to the channel financially. Hugely appreciate that my friends. Enjoy the show. And welcome back to Noita I'm Sufferev, let's suffer together back in the mountains my friends and today, well, well, <laughs> coming off a stream where not only did we have an amazing casual Noita run where we used, again, from top to bottom, both Omega Black Hole and Giga Nuke in wonderful ways and actually won that run. I might actually upload that run. It's about two hours long, so it was, it was fantastic. With glass cannon as well, so I look forward to that over the next few days. Also, I think we'll be able to get Helldivers content here on the tubes, man. And again, if you haven't seen or played Helldivers yet, one, you've been living under a rock, but allow me to remove that rock for you. Either over on the stream at twitch.tv forward slash forward slash Let's suffer together, or in hopefully some standalone content here for YouTube. Again, there will be separate original pieces of content, both on the stream and on YouTube, if I do any. So, uh, yeah. Or, you can go over to twitch.tv and check out the VODs of the stream. If you can't make it there while we're live, it's on the uh, videos page. You scroll down a little bit and you'll see the full videos for the full streams. But I hope you're doing well. It is bang middle of the week, so hey, we're just uh, getting all past hump day and whatnot. And, yeah, delicious little days. Well, we did some fine work today, both in Night Up and in Helldivers. Again, second day in Helldivers. Uh, tricky game. Very tricky in terms of... There's a lot of buttons to press in terms of... Oh, hello. Yeah, it's, uh, it's not overly complex, and, you know, it could be that I'm just, you know, having played games like this for a long time, going to an actual shooter now, which has a few more buttons to press in terms of, you know, getting loadouts and a lot of different things. A war? Yeah, it's, uh... It's a tricky little game. There's a lot. Uh, again, you kind of your fingers are a bit everywhere all the time, trying to protect yourself. And the bugs, man. Hey, to be fair, we haven't actually gone up against the robots yet. But in Hell Divers 2, yeah, go check out. Just do me a favor, right after this video, go check out Hell Divers intro. That's all you need to put into YouTube, and it'll be the top. Uh, Hell Divers 2 intro, I should say. Hell Divers 2. And go check that out, and if you're not impressed with, one, that cutscene alone, and the amount of effort and the amount of love they've put into that, that is the same amount of love and effort they've put into the game. And it's just, it's got so much personality that it's hopefully, it's going to be a wonderful, I'm bringing it to you all, there you go, bringing it to you all here on the tubes, as well as over on the stream, over on Twitch. Ah, I kind of would like to kick that a few times, but it's over there, and I'm here. <laughs> So, uh, that'd be a bit too much of a diversion. I need some... Oh, I do have orb. I do have the uh, bolts now I could go get the orbs with. The customary two orbs we always get. You get some HP. Yes. Make the boss fight harder. Oh, gold. Hey, very nice. Nearly 400 already. I mean, a little bit shy, but hey, we'll solve that. No problem. But let's go get any orbs, of course, with the old... Uh, Mountain Pyramid Portal mod installed as well. Cut down the time it takes to get two orbs. But again, I hope you all are, I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Again, we do not know what we're doing until we uh, do it here in these casual runs, as you may well know. But I do have the intention of, uh, shall we say, being a little bit silly. Maybe some shifts, but my priority. God, oh, Mister. To be fair, it was falling off the side. You know, the intention to blow up everything uh, in many ways, in sh many ways, shape or forms. It's going to... I doubt I'll be able to do as much destruction as I did on the stream with the Omega Black Hole and the Giga Nuke. But if we find both and Glass Cannon and have a repeat of that, well, then surely we will do it. I also had Explosion Immunity, so it just came together for a very nice stream run. Yeah. 
Hey, I haven't played a first-person shooter in so long as well. It's been actually ages, and it's really kind of nice getting back into one, to be honest. A good one instead of something like COD or, you know, something where they're just pumping them out once every year and not really giving them attention to detail. Helldivers 2 has so much kind of nuance and intricate detail. Even from two days of playing, I'm noticing that. Oh, that's good. That's good spin right there. Yo, oh, that's reasonable. I'll take it. Again, even if you're... Even if you're like, oh, I only like... No, you're, no, you're uh, you know. To be fair, I am really biased towards roguelikes. Mainly because I think in the indie game market to begin with. But even within that, I'm very... Right, I am very stubborn about the games I play. But I do get a feeling, especially over on Twitch, and maybe just a lot of... Uh, is that fungus? Oh, that's like plant material, right? No, it wasn't fungus. I think it might just be gamers in general are really stubborn. And I get it, right? But there's some... The problem is that stubbornness kind of leaks into being a little bit abusive towards yourselves. Because you should... Yeah, but you need... Sometimes you need to be open, you know, about the uh, experiences you take in. And not let previous previous experiences you know dominate your train of thought it's easy to go oh i like this so i'll concentrate on sticking on this and if this satisfies me i don't need to be satisfied in any other way they you don't know, and with certain things i'd agree but with video games being an art form in terms of entertainment as well as you know an artistic medium I don't know, being a bit more open into how, what type of art you enjoy. I feel like, uh, maybe it's more than a game thing, you know? Maybe it's just the world's getting more stubborn in various ways. I'm not saying that in a negative way. Well, maybe I am, but maybe I'm not also. Yeah, you know, take it how you will. We shall certainly see you again. Also, it's actually for a... Yeah, I don't know if it's a AAA game. I don't know if you describe it as that. It's definitely uh, better than most AAA games that have been put out. But so are most independent games, you know? So that's not saying much. But it also is saying quite a lot for the game. Considering the third person and sometimes first person shoot them up action. That is basically Starship Troopers, the game, but done in such a way that uh, actually... Because I think that was a Starship Troopers game, right? I'm not sure if that was any good. I haven't read much about it, but I'm sure I saw some on the tubes, the YouTubes. Which suggested there was a Starship Troopers game, unless it was a mod of some kind, which I have no idea about. But yeah, if you value my uh, opinion at all, and you find yourself quite stubborn in games, like myself, uh, like, hey, take my word for it. It's definitely worth a bit of an investigation anyway. Maybe not putting the $30 down. I think it might be $40 because it's £30. Which, to be fair, for a game of that standard, multiplayer game, that is, it's a live services game, but and it has microtransactions, but don't let that fool you. The microtransactions in the game are actually really fair. And I'm actually quite stubborn in my dislike of... And, well, I think microtransactions and loot boxes and whatnot are ruining the entire gaming space. But this live services game for Helldivers is actually done right. It's not like pay to win or anything like that. You just get a few things earlier, maybe get a few different coloured things on your cape or whatnot, I don't know, fully, but I know it's not imperative that you pay for any enjoyment of the game, which is really nice and refreshing. These devs seem to... And it's one of the reasons I've gotten into the game. Well, I get into the game... I get into games that, obviously, play well and what I enjoy, but also, especially because I'm a streamer, and 
in early access games, I need to kind of trust... The, if I'm going to put any sort of time into a game, I kind of need to trust the devs. They're going to do their job and will continue to do their job, even if they get obscenely rich. And that could breed laziness, you know what I mean? And they have a certain passion for their art, like Noita, Gungeon, Undermine, and many others. But now, I can definitely say Helldivers 2 and the devs definitely belong in that kind of... They have a certain respect for their own art and don't want to, you know, sully their art. Unlike AAA gaming companies that really just are looking for the money here and there, everywhere, right? Regardless of the art of gaming. And that's, again... I think they're called Broken Arrow? The depths of... I think, anyway. I think that's something I recall. I haven't found any HP wandering around here. I've been ch chatting them. Nothing. Oh, no. Ah. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. How terrible. Hey, hopefully we'll get glass cannon right away. And that won't matter. Teleport, though. Very nice. It isn't glass cannon, but it is edit, which is phenomenal. Obviously. Because I don't really need teleport anymore, but I will get it. Because I want to maneuver around relatively quickly. Not for any great purpose, apart from, you know, having a bit of a smoother and more well-maintained and quicker run. But now I've got edit, I don't really need to worry about these ones as much and can go searching for better ones. Instead of spending my money, so we can save it for the re-rolls later. Yeah, this is decent enough. And we've got explosive still. But yeah, for anyone who has played Helldivers 2, uh, get down in the comments, sound off about what you think about the game. You know, good or bad, I don't mind, you yeah. know? I respect all people's opinions, even if you think it's bad. I disagree. Oh, hello. I disagree, but, uh... Hey. Like, why would you... Like, why do you find it bad? I'm interested to hear that as well. I kind of seriously doubt there will be any of you suggesting that it is um, hot garbage. But you never know. I'd like to leave that open as a possibility. Yeah, this is going to be a wonderful little weapon now. With the extra damage. Hey, that's the kind of start you want. You know, it's the nice rate of fire. DPS. Ah, couldn't teleport out of the way quick enough. Yeah, stuff's been going on here. Just want a quick scout around, to be honest. Uh, sp let me through. They're spinning. Whoa, I'm sorry. What? You well, I didn't do that. And now I'm stuck in a wheel. Like, you get proper stuck in these. I prefer not to. Prefer to get through. Ah, uh, that'll do. This looks interesting. Okay. A homing. Always cast. I'll take that uh, right now. Thank you very much. So I can... I don't really like freezing. Hey, Mist of Spirits? I think I will. But I can switch this round, I think. And then shoot multiple shots out with the extra damage. Oh, hell yeah. That's what we do. This is going to go hard. It's going to be one shot for most people. Wrong one. Wrong one. Right one. 144 crit. Not bad. We'll see what it does without creating a sec. Uh, all the shots didn't hit the target though. I need a bit of a heavy dude to all the shots hit the target and register the shots. Have the damage number come up. 65 crit, 42. Yeah, these guys ain't showing the full damage number because they're weaklings who don't deserve my attention. Uh, let's go over. Oh, it's on fire, burn. But yeah, the short range homing is insanely powerful on an always cast. Again, yeah, this aiming is no longer a thing you need to really do. And with the TP, 
we can get into some really good smooth moves here. Eradicate. I mean, we, could, we haven't got explosion immunity, so we could smooth move right into it. Boom. Hmm. I want to get in there. There is a thing I could do. Nah, I need a notch downward. There we go. This might work. Might roll out. No, it's fine. And we get the gold as well on the floor. Little bits. And since we've got edit, we'll definitely take as much as we can. I got edit in the first holy mountain gives you the most amount of inventory. We'll, we'll pay for the chainsaw. I could actually potentially use it now to speed this up. I would have to take one of the sparkies off. Beautiful. I just don't need that rate of fire at the moment. But if there are, like, many people around... Yeah, where's the HP? Hey, you never know what you might need. It's definitely gonna... No matter what, this uh, wand is definitely gonna limit the damage we receive. Uh, that's problematic. I might need to drop a boom on that. I can't risk it if it's an Uko stone. Yeah, there's a wand... Pollen, I'll take a few of those, thank you very much. Ditch the one, though. No. Yeah, I don't mind. I accidentally put in a... Sparky on that. So you see what I mean? It's not running out of mana that fast, because it's got quite nice mana consumption. Versus its max mana charge speed. Please don't blow it up. I prefer you didn't. You got the water down. Hey, at least we got that singular HP, so if we don't get glass cannon... Someone's got a wand. I heard a pump off a bolt right there. Hey, but how's your year been going again? Apparently... Whoa, okay. Dominiton. Dominiton, eh? That's a mixture of vomit and bone dust. It should have come from a potion, though, here. There's no reason Dominiton, which is a new liquid in the game from the updates. I think this might be one of the first times we've properly seen it in the YouTube vids. Like, on stream, with, if you, right, if you add more acid to Dominiton, you get more Dominiton. It's intra it, like, it's confused the hell out of me sometimes. Um, but one of those, you can make as much Dominiton as you want, as long as you've got a tiny bit of Dominiton, you pour acid into it. So you can get a farm going, of course. Is there anything in there that I'd like? Oh. Yeah, I'm not too concerned. 131 HP. Yeah, that was definitely from a potion, right? Right there. That's a lot of it, though. I wonder if any liquid being poured into... Nah, because you wouldn't have any other liquid on it. If any liquid turned into Dominion. Hmm. Kind of want to get up there, but I kind of don't want to work for it. <laughs> you know, I just want to. I just. I just want to get up there. Hey, we're taking out everybody in good order. Just need a sack. Oh, hello, sir. See what I mean? No worries. As long as I've got my TP and smooth moves, and eh, nothing will get me. Just a good reaction time as well. Hold on, I've got an idea. I can show you if I don't kill. Okay, nah, sir, you wanna not be on fire. My entire point was to show people. Whoa, okay. He died. Yeah, if you could just shoot over here, lad. Um. Where do I, I want him to shoot over here? Because this might be easier to see. Quickly now. Yeah, you can see it adding more dominions and. Yeah, you can see getting more and more and more. The acid is eating the terrain and making more dominions and... It's pretty cool. We're going to have a load of it. Hey, come on, sir. All the way around? Okay, you do as you will. I want to make a bathtub, you know, a, a big size bathtub. A swimming pool <laughs> size. 
Yes. Swimming pool size. Get dangerous, but again, we. Ugh. Right. I would shoot my um, other wand. I don't know if it's flammable or not. You see, just growing. Yeah, keep on it. Keep on at it, man. Oh, dear me. Interesting. Oh, I, I was about to say, I could just Ambrosia, but he can also just uh, keep on missing. <laughs> oh, I have been diminutinized. Definitely don't want that. Look at the green, though, it glows. Actually, yeah, if he just shoots here. Ah! Uh, oh! What? Nah, it's it just... You see that, though? That's the perfect example of it, right? Even the tiniest bit of the minute and now just... What, you see it kind of come in from the left on the top of the liquid pool? How it spread? Because of the acid? It's like it turned all the water into the minute and as well, because of the acid. Again, an interesting one for you, that. It's also eating terrain. Which I think is the acid. Um, being on... I don't know. Definitely seen it eat acid before. And the acid reaction still be on bottom. <laughs> this guy is doing glorious work, though, for me. It's exactly what I wanted. I don't know why, by the way, I want to do this. I just felt like, uh, you know, I should. Yep. And we'll uncover the rest of this glorious place. Let's probably put my uh, magic arrow back on. Wonder if I could turn this into machine gun. Oh no, we'll shift with Dominion. I can jump in it and get Dominionized. It's just dangerous to do so. And. I need a sack. Or at least I need a potion, right? At least I need a spare potion. That I can fill in Dominion with. That's another Ambrosia. We'll go invisible for now. Oh, wander around these places and see what's happening. It ain't no sack. Another uh, invis here. Oh, I think I will. Thank you very much. can just stand and take the shots, to be honest. It ain't no uh, problematic dude. So, uh, if I'm shifting, I want to turn more stuff into, into the minison. Because it's not the most naturally occurring substance. If you're on the beta branch, I'm, you'll have probably seen it. But I'm guessing you wouldn't have seen that much of it. Unless you've done some... Whoa. What? I see him, don't worry. Stuff, is it me or does stuff feel like it's already been shifted? A few vibes. Another Ambrosia? Are you kidding me? Spread everyone. It's incredible. An incredible little fungal with no HP. What is that? Not a sack. Uh, chaotic polymorphing. Okay. Thank you, I suppose. I'm sorry, how can I not get you? Oh, I see him. He's got a little pixel notch. Saving them. Yeah, we got all the money we needed out on this. I don't really want to be poisoned. Toxed, I should say. But, you know. <laughs> Oh, I got a book. Interesting. What is that? I don't think it's anything that we want, but this is money central here. I would trick kill them, but... Nah, I don't really have the setup. To go to work on them, you know? 
Sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. Right, I'm gonna have to do this. Whoa, much. Oh no. no, 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 no. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, beautiful. Thank you. Firestone. Uh, of course. How would we have thought it was anything different? This soul is a firestone. So, of course, we have enough for tripping. We have enough Dominion. I want to turn something else into Dominion, but it could also get rid of Dominion. Right, I've got a 70% chance. It uses the potion I'm holding. And then, on top of that, you know, if it does have that 70% chance, it's also, you know, 50-50, whether it's on one side or the other. So it doesn't hurt you just jumping into it, that's fine. It's just that I'm not also that sure on the process of how it works, whether, say you have 1% Dominion Stain, or 100%, does that change the amount of, you know, damage you receive um, from being hit? Because this basically causes more damage when you get hit from one thing or another. Say you'd normally take 10 damage, well you might take like 20, 30, 40. But I know it can be variable, I'm sure it can be variable, so... Who knows? Well... If we make more of it, maybe we'd find out, but, uh... We need the fung. And if all this changes into something else... That'd be kind of annoying. But it, it is what it is, of course, as all things are. Okay, that hurt. Was I? Yeah, oh, I had the minuton on. So you see, the poison hurt me more. So any source of damage. That was really stupid of me, by the way. Mainly because I'm not used to the minuton. I couldn't spray ambrosia on myself, or it didn't catch. Which would have saved me. And that is a real shame, but how many runs have you had? <laughs> to distract from my glaring incompetence. How many runs have you had that had such promise that was taken away from you? So I feel no shame. And, uh, yeah, kind of glad to have at least shown you one thing in that run. Let's go find another thing we can show. This will be a tiny bit more pace on it now. We've already spent the old half an hour on that run. But... Oh, broken one, very nice. But hopefully it shall be just as entertaining. Yeah, that was really stupid of me, and uh, I thought I'd already washed off the Dominion, to be honest. But that's how dangerous it is. Think about it. Any source of damage amplified. I'm not sure. How, I'm not sure the actual tick rate of the min, uh, the poison from eating stuff eating stuff off the floor. I'm not sure how much damage that should have done compared to what it did do, and how much mistain was. You know. But, that's part one of the science. I'm not sure why Dominion was there in the first place. Probably out of a chest, or... Just a potion standing there. It can be out of a potion. It's very rare, though. And I'm glad to find this one, to Beat people around the head with. I need me some ones. Has he got a one down there, that fire dude? Look like it. Ooh. Interesting. You stop being you. <laughs> Do me a favor. Stop being you. Just for a moment. No, you don't go down the hole. Thank you. Okay. That was pretty cool. If I can launch this box up... Oh, oh that was too much. I was trying to hope to launch it off the gunpowder as a ramp to get it in there. But this box is just being all sorts of... What? How much flight did that have there? You know what I mean? It was just flying everywhere. I wasn't even kicking it that hard. Or it shouldn't have done. That's not the greatest I've ever seen. Yeah, we'll head over. We can get up and get our orbs again. Yeah, that whole thing I though, I mean, did we get much use out of it? It was still collected a lot of things.
We did some good in the world. You know, I told everybody about some vicious green liquid that's out there. It's going to get you hurt. Hey, if it hurts me, it'll hurt you. Yeah, not to... Whoa! Not to toot my own horn, but, uh, you know. Uh, you know what I've done. And if you don't, to find out by asking. <laughs> uh, you know the levels of things we've gone to in this game to achieve great success. But like I said, if you don't, ask around. Not that that makes me uh, a good one builder or anything. Like, my talents lie outside of, shall we say, expert one building. <laughs> um, my one building... Right, I like to think that my one building is bad, but I'm able to do the most epic things ever seen in Nighter in terms of challenges, despite the fact, you know? My one building is terrible, which makes it even more impressive, eh? <laughs> I like to think so. But to be fair, you know, we all in our own mind make up, um, you know, <laughs> and glorify who and what we are, to some extent, beyond what is actually true, right? Uh, being self-aware is kind of handy sometimes. Also, it's kind of bad. Well, I want to delude myself into thinking I'm badass, <laughs> you know? Why does self-awareness have to come into it and ruin everything? Yeah, we'll go on a bit of a uh, expedition now. See what the game can offer me as consolation for my willing sacrifice. Yeah, I did it on purpose. Whoa! Got some fresh air then. Nice. I'd love me some, uh, you know... Uh, Outside ventilation source. There, that hole is too big enough for Metal Gear Solid Man, Solid Snake to come crawling through. Not that kind of air vent, is it? Now, with that toxic, I could have gone and made weird fungus. Weather, the weather report. Yeah, at least we get another kick of Scully. Because the other one. Did we kick Scully last time? Go up. Oh, not bad. 3.76543211 points. Yes, that's what it was. Right, just don't stay on fire. That's the one rule. Don't stay on fire. You can be on fire, just don't stay on fire. And it's the same principle in real life. <laughs> hey, you might set yourself on fire a little, just don't stay on fire. A guiding principle that will, you know, keep you whole to a certain point. Maybe not keep you safe, safe, but... Hopefully... Oh, no, that's two toxic sludge potions in one little... Degenerate little hole of a biome. What are you doing to me again? I didn't pick up the tablet, which I really should have done. The cash money endeavors. Hey, do we need to know? Watch out. Merciless is what it is. I didn't even know. <laughs> Again, I've messed with it a few times, but I've never really taken that much damage while I've had it on me, because, well, I normally didn't stand near the enemy. And eating things off the floor, okay, it can damage you from time to time, but it's not something you worry about too much. And that was my fault. I jumped into that. Like I jump into a lot of shots, but that just feels... Felt bad. Yeah, should have got the tablet. Mainly because I can't take out that dude now. What is that? It's an unstable telling. Yeah, maybe we utilize it. Oh, he down. Spray the man down with fire. Uh, I'd love to go check that one, but I've, I'm busy. You know, I've been preoccupied to get stuff done. 
Since we're already a little bit behind. A glass cannon would be the best. Wouldn't it? Oh, that's trash, man. I didn't get enough to re-roll again after this, and... Oh, no. Angry? We've had the Minison. Which, you know, make, gives you a sad face. So we take more hatred to have, you know, the sadness spread around. You know, we'll do the old, uh, you know, despicable human behavior of I feel bad, thus other people will feel bad. Why hurt myself when I can hurt other people? It was once up by someone. I think that was off The Walking Dead, right? <laughs> was that by Merle? I can't remember. It's too long. Probably. Merle was into Merle was into some despicable issues, you know. Although I never watched I never actually watched all of The Walking Dead. Apparently in a new one. Well the one with Rick and Michelle. Doing alright. Although I won't be wasting my time watching it. Yeah, we'll have the one in five saw blade technologies, just to keep me on my toes. And we'll head to Fungus, try and get some, you know, we'll pop in, pop out, try and get some Fungus real quick. <laughs> Keep me on my toes. I mean, sometimes you just gotta play with the stuff it gave you, and it gave me a nice little sword blade. What was that to do? It's the only reasonable thing to do. Can't ignore all the money. I am guilty of that sometimes. On quicker runs of just kind of, you know, being something that would take like half a second. Just ignoring it. Just because I would have to change direction. <laughs> I could get money with this, but I don't got the time. Just need a bit of a balance. Upgrade from no money to, you know, a little bit of money. Hey, you know, you can do the same for me in real life with Kofi forward slash LST link down below. Hey, whether it's a one off contribution or anything like that. Yeah, that's where the financial support can go aside from the join button down below where the renegades. Contribute monthly. Anyway, enough shilling. And more killing. <laughs> hey, that's a great tagline for a video game. Video game stream. That's not going to do anything. That's just a waste of a bomb. But I knew that. Yeah, I did it anyway. We come up across... Yeah, it's sending me up and down, up and down. Yeah, these saw blade noises, so good. Ah, it's just a big wooden... Holy... Nice. We'll get the one. Doesn't look decent. Teleport, though. It's a long teleport. Hey! <laughs> ah. I work my ass off and all you want to do is take it away. Hey, because dig our way through here. No need to... Oh! Have you seen what it is? Two very different bio... Oh, that was painful. Two very different biomes. <laughs> the tale of two fungal biomes it is. Why do I always jump into shots? You know, I think. Do you do that like professionally? Jump into enemy shots. It's always the first one as well. You know, one <sighs> kind of confused about how the arc of their shot is going to go and you just jump into it. Hmm. Well, this is why we get the old. Uh, 
Oh, another one. Come on, man. It's humid in here. The problem is, all that money is going to have gone. Again. Where's the. Why is, why is the. Why is the Ambrosia? Whoa. Yeah, we got broken ones again. You stop. You're not allowed to teleport around these parts. It's illegal. I'm not sure why that seemed like a bigger explosion than normal. God damn. Man. Oh, we have a bit of a conundrum. Yeah, get rid of the water. Now I've got the old uh, broken one. Mm, twice over. Acid potion. All right. Two broken ones and a sack. Right, empty the sack, it's got copper. Just need some fungus. That's all. That's all we ever wanted. Another broken wand? No, we're all about that broken wand lifestyle, right? Ooh, they're gas. Anyway, sorry. Oh, that's a bit danger close, wasn't it? You're gonna let me through? Good. Oh dear. <laughs> and we have teleport though, so. And we can dig with our wand as well, so. Uh, no harm, no foul here. I feel everything's going to be alright until you get... Until you smash that potion I was looking at. What's this? In... Oh, look at that one. Oh, we don't have edit anymore, do we? Oh, why did I was thinking we got the edits? Hey, don't you dare show me. There is another broken one, by the way. <laughs> there is another broken one. Um, no, I'll I'll shift once now, right? And take all four broken ones. I don't have time to shift that much anyway. We've got to get the business include. No, why am I doing that? I'm putting it back in the sack while eating it. It will hold a broken wand while shifting. That wouldn't do anything. Maybe it doesn't. You don't know unless you try. There we go. Get rid of it. Hold broken wands. And we're out of it. Come on, something interesting. Invisibility. Yes. Not really doing much for me. I kind of got to take that one, right? Hmm. 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 Mainly because I want the always cast. Yeah, we'll find new projectiles to work with. But we need to get out of here right now. Can we head down... A normal way? We can. Hey, finally getting to the third floor. And we did get enough for a reroll here. <laughs> Terrible. Yeah, I need to get a new projectile. One I really don't like that much. But one that uh, certainly help out. And we've got the crystals as well. The trick kills for money. Ain't nothing gonna go wrong here. Everything's gonna be all right. Man, look so. Th yeah, if we're in trouble, we'll just find a safety snowman. But I can shoot off the luminous drill. Yeah, that'll work. I don't have an. Oh, I do have a natural level. Can I do it without the luminous drill? Why is everything so bad? <laughs> I think it'd be a lot better. That cast delay is kind of killing me though. Hence why I might want to do this. On a long enough timeline, this will anger the gods. There we go. That'll do something. Right, primary. 
Not TP. I'm not going to get rid of. I can't use that as a TP one, by the way. It won't happen. Unless I... I couldn't... Nah, I'd need to work that quite well to be able to use that and not get hurt along the way. I'm sorry, where's my TP? There you go. Ain't that nice? Yeah, I kind of... I can't really fully auto this because it runs out of mana, so it chokes. So I need to kind of keep on pressing the shooting button to kind of give it a few frames where it can reload. The mana? Ah, another, another non-shuffle. Yeah, the, the arrow actually has some good points about it, but it's just because it bounces and hurts you. Never been a fan. Of course, Holy Lance now exists. We'll do far. Oh, we're worm hunting now. Oh, there we are, worm hunting. That was my fault. And we get paid out as well. Do I have drill? Ah, I do have drill, but it's on the explosive. And another one! I'll take these guys out, make sure they're not angering the gods from it. And we'll chug a load of beverage. Tasty! And wonderful smoothie beverage. Unparalleled, you know, chunky with pulp. Not some pulp, but with pulp. Ah, oh, come on, man. What have I ever done to you, game? Hmm. Well, I suppose that depends on what the game holds a grudge over. I can't take the potion anyway, because I've got four broken ones. I'm looking to get into. Oh, I did it. Very nice. Which we need because of the broken ones. And now I've got all saying, I, I don't think there's much we need to change because we didn't. I don't want the drill on that one. Oh, no, I can't do that because it's got the. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's got the spiral, the uh, orbital plasma. Hey. Ooh, it's an interesting one. Especially with the earthquake, which allows me to take out the boss. What I'm hoping for is another broken one. Oh, sorry, medic, I didn't see that, bro. Yeah, you know, sometimes you just misidentify. You know, most witnesses, <laughs> most witnesses in trials are incorrect. Which means at the point at which they thought they remembered, at the point at which they, you know, actually experienced what they experienced, they were already wrong, you know what I mean? They weren't just wrong at the trial, they've always been wrong. <laughs> oh, hello. oh, come on, man, that's evil. He did it on purpose. And I'm not, again, I'm not the biggest fan of these glowings. Mainly because of the arc and the self damage and everything else. They're just very rude. We're getting some decent money though. Yeah, we'll take that. You know, the minor explosive. Uh, <laughs> yeah, minor explosive will. Amplify everything we're doing here for days. Yeah, this is certainly allowing me a certain level of aggression, though, so I can't complain. And um, the glowing lance will receive an honorary um, pardon. Whoops, it is it. That could have killed me. I'll tell you what, though, we're about to be inundated with some good stuff. Finally! We're bringing it all together. 
don't know. Although I would like to do that. I'm not sure I can afford it. No, I'll take the home in. Alright, you do, you propane. I'll take the timer. And... Hmm. I kind of want... I always can, but it's just too slow to do anything good. Oh, yeah. We do get a LARPA explosion, though. So, all in all, mediocre, as it goes. I won't say I'm too impressed with what I just received, but... Eh, we got some good stuff. It certainly wasn't offensive. Oh, it does explode. Hey. What do you know? Also, this turns into a nice little uh, loomy drum. As and when I need it. You, that's what I say, you serious? Oh dear. Ah. Oh! <laughs> oh. These people. The health and safety regulations for Hisu. Considering they're a technologically advanced folk and obviously evolved up to a certain point, right? Yeah, you'd think they'd uh, have sorted that out. They need to keep them in safe environments. But they don't. We really need to workshop with these dudes, you know? <laughs> Give them a uh, bit of a question and answer session based on do they think they could be doing better and then we'll workshop on them. You know, seeing what we can do to help. Is there a HP under there? There isn't. But there is that wand. If anything, I just dig from underneath it, let the lava flow, and then we're done. It's already leaking anyway, because that's what lava does to metal. I don't have any water, but luckily, the snow will condense. Condensate. All over me. Now I'll take the trip. But we don't have unlimited yet, so I can't use the LARPA forever. Hey, a shield actually paid off. I'm gonna save my life. <laughs> I don't really feel like I need more drills. I don't think I've been needing, needing to speed up ones that much. And even if I did, or digging through terrain. Hey, come here, you. That's what I thought. Well, we died with the wand. And that'll be the last one we get him, I think. Alright, a bit of speed up on that. Never complain about a little bit of speed up. Okay, why is this now... firing smoother, you know what I mean? You make no sense, game. You're confused, man. Boomerang. Ah, oh, well. Ah, oh, come on. People would have loved that game. The double gamble. I tried. You know. I tried, guys. Game said no. Now, what I'm going to do here is obvious. And obvious what I should be doing with this. Some level. Now, I have 20 of these shots, and they are very devastating, and will do a lot of damage. Now, I do have LARPA Explosion as well, but, um, not entirely sure. I mean, this by itself is insane. The amount of damage that'll do. Ooh. 
we shall see. But yeah, since I've got edit, I don't need to really worry. And we've run out of worm blood as well. Let's go marching before he angers the constant. Whoa. Beautiful. Um, I should probably have a secondary wand. Whoa! Hey. God damn, that is savage. All those explosions all in one go. Now I have got no war, because I'm still, obviously. You know, my brain's catching up from before. <laughs> Come on, get it off me. Oh, this game and it's stains, man. Oh, well, the way it turned back then. Yeah, I need a secondary wand. What are you doing, son? I mean, that will do. It won't really be able to afford the homing on it. Uh, rotate or regular homing? That's a question. 70 to 40. Ah, oh, now we used a 40 mana there. Right, I've got an idea. It's just a quick one. But we will need to save most of our... Oh, future shots. I really wish I had TP. Didn't we have TP? Oh, we do. Nice. Oh, can't do it that. Whoa, now. Oh, no. Ugh. I mean, this is the home of liquid, mate. In it. That's what you get when you mess with the warrior. Do I have TP yet? That's not gonna. Oh, they're fine each other. Yes. Right, see you later. Oh, no, wrong one. <laughs> I mean, that could go pretty hard. Oh, I'm going to need to stand my ground for a sec. Ah, how tiresome. Ah, <laughs> uh, because what am I going to TP with now? If I want to keep my secondary. I mean, I could just get rid of the notion. Yeah, I probably do. Oh my god, man, they hit so hard. Yeah, I have to say goodbye to the triple. Yeah, just let me over, man. Why do you block me up? Why do you find such, such satisfaction in doing this to him? People. At least uh, I can still do it that way. I've got no water. God damn, man. I've been covering myself in all sorts of glory. I've got to go. There's no way I can really sustain being that stupid for that long. <laughs> hey, explosion me, though. Of course. Hurt lottery doesn't work. Why would it? I mean, I do have... Um, I do question competent... Well, not the competency, but the ability for this one to be sped up. But we shall see. Yeah, I just don't need that many... Uh, I need more. I need more speed up, which, to be fair. That's a really good secondary one in terms of 
If I'm looking to pop people with the freezing gaze. Getting this off now and again. I want as many doubles on it as possible. And if I can have that. Homing will take away a lot of the... Mana, but... Do I really need to worry about that all that much? So there's any wrong ones. Yeah, I really don't want that on there. We shall continue where we left off. <laughs> oh, that was close. That was nearly a massive slip up. And of course, I've still got no potion. <laughs> still got no potion, but this is such a simply nice one. Like, both. I've got a lot of love for the little thunderballs here. He, j <laughs> he had a little jump. He did a hop. Where did his what? Did he hop, hop his wand away as well? There it is. Holy, yeah. is that what you're into these days, lad? What, will you not smother it? Really? Am I going to have to turn myself into a sheep to protect myself from fire here? Really? Yep, that is exactly what I'm going to have to do. Mainly because I reset myself on fire, meaning I, I was basically going to take 50% damage. Again. And that would have meant I'm dead. Almost certainly. Yeah, but it's been a charming little run so far. I'd like to keep it charming. The game would uh, keep me alive for an extra little while. Well. That's nice, isn't it, game? Thanks. Just need a tiniest bit of liquid, not the poly. Oh, there is. Oh, come on! Right then. Oh, we're probably doomed here. Oh, no, the, oh, the blood. Are you serious? I might die. No, we're fine. <laughs> oh, come on. The game knows something, and it wants me doomed. It doesn't want me around anymore. I can buy exactly one of these ones. I mean, if I came back, but you know. Coming to and fro ain't my style. Although there is the mana, but I don't feel like I need it. You always cast acid. Chaos Lava. Because this is quite a sexy non shot. Hmm. Trying to figure out what bounce would do for me here, but probably nothing. It's a reroll. Oh, yeah! That is fantastic. Because I'm wondering if I can explosion lap on this. Yeah, we can. Look at that now. The explosion lap up, causing it to be a little bit more poppy, shall we say? Just a bit more vicious. On occasion. Ooh, what is that? Oh, that's just a statue still being electrified. So we've become... We're explosion immune anyway, so it's just the acid that'll hurt. Yes, this is now the... Electric Eviscerator Wand. I'd like to have a gander at that. If the game would be so kind, so let me... Does this dig? Not really. It's all 
all I theoretically need to do is get the lava out. I still have no water. That's kind of taking too long. <laughs> but it will be done. Yeah, let's not be impatient here. That'll do. I just needed this slope clear so I could do this. Are you serious? You camping, son of a... Wow. What a cheat, man. I'll tell you what, though. We could now choose. This is a quad itself. Yeah, quadruple, so. Oh, cool. I have a double. I don't necessarily need a double when I can just slap down as well. Well, I have a double. Just so I can one plus it. I kind of want to put a spiral on it for no reason. Apart from the fact I think it'll be cute. Just have a little spiral in the mix, you know? I mean, I could add another freezing gauge, but... Oh, we've got unlimited of them now. I can just fire out as much as I want. But even when it ran out of mana, it still does a little bit of its job. What I kind of want to do. Which will require me to go back to four, and what I wanted to do all along was this. Splash damage time. Look at this. Of course, those shots could be theoretically used against me in certain conditions. If it takes out one of those in one shot, we're in a really good place. But what was that that got fired? Was it Polly? Yeah, if we get swapped, what, uh, we have explosion immunity, sir. What are you firing each other for? That's harsh. I've got no water, as you well know. And unfortunately, Oh, no, I'm not on fire anymore. Good. All right, that was sick. The way that presented then and just spread out in a 360 degree angle. And yeah, let's just, if we get set on fire against them. So. All right, this is one of my favorite ones of the day. And I've made some bangers today. I mean, ah, oh, no. This is probably over. Hold on, no, do it, do it, pop it, pop it, pop it, pop, 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 go pop, yes! That saved my life, that. Again, much like with the poly before. Get through the curse rock. Oh, beautiful, and we're not on fire anymore, right? Oh, well, I'm gonna... Boom! Yeah, I've got to watch out for these exploding, um... Things. Be very careful now. In all moves, in all angles. All directions. Ah! That's so scary. Boing. I was about to say, why didn't the explosion take him out there? Maybe I just didn't have enough mana. There you go, weakened him. And finished him off. Probably go down here, though. Until I realise there's no way that way. Alright, where's TP? Oh, I got rid of TP1? For what reason? I just dropped it on the floor and never picked it up, didn't I? One of those 
Old chestnuts. Considering this was a really rushed run, you know what I mean? And I've not really been taking care of myself. I'm kind of impressed. All this curse, though. Oh, no. You're not making me go all the way over here. And luckily, this is a timer as well, so... All right, why? Are you not doing the explosion? There you go. What's so hard about that? What's so hard about that game? Are you making a fool out of me? Well, how very day. And, um... <laughs> yeah, thanks, Perk Lottery. I'd like to have seen what the, uh... Gamble was, to be honest. That'd have been pretty cool. Although, I did want to do something against our man, call me. Yeah, just in case. In case? In case. A bit of rain. A bit of rain will work. Never hurt anybody. I mean, there is something I... The sensible thing was to put Weakening Curse on, but... Hold on. The fire arc on these? wonder how that'd present. You can't really see it, can you? It's all a bit too... frosty. Of course, the... freezing gaze from the LARPA explosion won't be modified. But... Yeah, I mean, the fact is we can get burnt quite easy, and now we can't. I love this one. It's fierce! For me and Coleman, once again. Oh, don't bother, mate. Oh, yeah, putting water down with the electricity falling me is smart. Yo! Interesting. Um, that should work. <laughs> that should work. Right. Right then. You do realise how lucky we are to have edit in this situation, right? Here we are. Oh! What do you do? I'll just wander out here and... See about blasting my way through. Um, I mean, I suppose that's the answer, isn't it? Just earthquake again. Have things just. Uh, I don't have my TP, so. Gotta watch it a little bit. Right, let me just try and blast underneath. Oh, hold on. Could we literally just get under that now? And in. This is dangerous. Yeah, we made it. Very nice. Hmm. Oh, it's... It's vicious. I was wondering if it would uh, LARP or anything like that. I kind of knew it wouldn't. But hey ho! And thank you for joining me again. What a lovely little run. 
Hey, if you like lovely little runs like that, you'll love what we do over at twitch.tv forward slash let's suffer together, where they were playing a bit of Night Elite Company. Some of the old games we used to play, like Enter the Gungeon and Undermine. Got anything new that's coming out, like Helldivers 2 we're getting into as well. Hey. Lovely little runs and a lovely little, you know, more interactive and more personable. You know, time over the over at the stream instead of me just talking instead of me just talking to, mis, to myself. Well, you know, talking to you via proxy, I suppose. You know, the proxy of nothingness and my own imagination. Hey, you know, having chat over on Twitch. Hey, it can make the world. It just makes it an entirely form, entirely different form of entertainment. But it's always nice to see the renegades out there, meet you all, get to know you all, and to have fun playing video games. Now we all enjoy. Uh, if you did enjoy the content, though, hey, don't, don't be wasting my time. You got a like button down there, right? You've got to press, and of course, and of course, it's uh, you know, life and society and civilization as we know it that England brought to each one of you. You know, the social contracts, my friends. You know, and I put out this content at free for the point of access. And hey, that like button's there. I mean, you know, you don't have to, but to be fair. I would argue that you kind of owe it if you enjoyed the content, right? You know, considering how much it helps me. Yep, you owe me. And that's all you owe me, in my opinion. You don't owe me anything else apart from anything else you might want to help benefit the channel and help keep this show on the road and keep it coming. Hey, I mean, one day it might just magically disappear if we can't keep it going and funded and whatnot, you know? So, hey, I mean, that's not a threat. That's actually just the future and reality, isn't it? So, it is what it is. I don't like the, I don't like saying that too often because it does sound like I'm like trying to in the old uh, content blackmail. Oh, give me a thousand pound or I won't give you content. You know, I never want to do that. I enjoy what I do. But, again, all those support ways are helping... One, mean a hell of a lot, and two, actually make substantial differences and changes, and um, allow us to continue doing what we're doing. Even the non-monetary stuff, but hey, like the join button down below, the people's names you saw at the start of the video. The join button is there for people who want to contribute monetarily on a monthly basis, whether it's, again, the, what is it, like five or six dollars a pounds and the one pound um, things we have. Hey, either way, it all adds up, it all helps, so... You got the like button, subscribe, and if you want to be notified about when we put out fresh content most days. Um, yeah, joining us at the stream. If you have Amazon Prime, that means you have a free Twitch Prime that you can subscribe to me on Twitch for free and help support what we do there. Again, another free way of supporting the content. And yeah, just check the description. You got the Discord for the home away from home for all the renegades who chill there. Be alerted when we put out content, whether it's the stream or here on YouTube. Ugh, it's like fucking four in the morning. I'm gonna go. I'll catch up with you soon, my friends. You take care. You know, take care of yourselves. Take care of someone else. I'll catch up with you soon. Hey, make sure you stay chill. Keep a level head. Hey, the world's crazy at the moment, guys. So, hey, you know, do the, uh, you know, the rebellious thing and stay sane. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's hard, I know. But, uh, hey, I'll be back in the next video. And the next stream tomorrow, you take it easy. Also, hey, follow me on Steam as well. Um, just let's supper together, all one word, on Steam. So if you do join us over on the stream, that you can join in and lead a lethal company or Helldivers or any other multiplayer game we play. Yeah, I'll be back. I'll, don't worry, I, I'm not gone forever. <laughs> I'll see you soon, guys. Take it easy. Peace. Hey, but a big thank you to the people, the pounders, the other selection of people who contribute to the stream, the yeah, stream, the content we do financially on a monthly basis. Thank you so much, guys. It all adds up. I really appreciate it. Again, from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much for considering to do so. You don't have to, and you do, and it's amazing. But I'll, I'll be gone, but I'll be back. Take it easy, guys. Much love. Peace.